Hi, I am Ratna. I am here on a research internship. I am working under Professor Rosia, Rosa Maria Paris. The topic of my internship is transmission of cultural codes through language and education. So this is where I work with people of Indian origin and I am getting to know how the traditions are followed, how the traditions are upheld and what has changed through, through their migration. That is the precise topic. I am making a documentary, um, through, through the process of making a documentary, I am meeting a lot of people and the experience has been wonderful because when before we get an interview, the rapport that we build with the respondents is life changing. Some conversations that I have had are uh, titillating, enlightening and something that I will never forget. The multiplicity at hostels has been wonderful because it is through the it is through the hostel. Uh, it's called Estrella. I'm seeing the entire world. I've made friends from France, Germany, and there are different countries. You know, the entire world comes together on a coffee table where we where we eat a banana and probably talk about what is up in this uh, what is up in Bolivia. What is, what is the political situation that's happening in Russia? So that is something that I'm going to take back from this experience. Because as an Indian student, when we discuss politics, it's always in theory. When I come here, I get to see the practical side of it. What I love about Lisbon is its roads and transport. Because as a student who commutes daily, about a distance of let's say 40 kilometers on an average, the roads are very well connected. We have metros, we have a metro pass. So you pay for it once and you can use it whenever and recharge it. So it's simple. And, and, it is, and the tourism. Each time you get to see a monument, there are, there are different people who want to see the same monument but then there are, you know, if we do not have guides, we simply listen to the other guides who are guiding the other people. So that way you even make friends and save money. Travelling alone, this, I don't know if it's a gender aspect but this is something that I've done a lot in Lisbon. Coming home at 3 or 4 in the morning after roaming around with friends and um, traveling alone whenever I want to on a very regular basis. It's almost become a habit now. I mean, sometimes I travel out of necessity, sometimes I do it because I love it, but it has opened up new doors, you know, a, a, new, a new sort of an acceptance level where you see yourself more as a human being with potential that can do whatever she wants to do. It's a feeling that one rarely accomplishes. And I think this internship has given me a well-rounded experience where I started to introspect more, where I started seeing myself more, something that I didn't know. Thank you.